We are learning more about the victims this morning uh, that were involved in this incident. If you take a look here behind me at the home where this all happened, uh, there are flowers there on the doorstep uh, outside the home. Now, the names of the couple uh, have not been revealed, so we're not going to reveal them at this point. Uh, but we did find out that the husband worked at Qualcomm as a software engineer. Here's what a coworker told us. He was also a very close friend and not just a team worker, but extremely close friend, uh, very gentlemanlike. Uh, he would not mean any offense to anybody in the team. He would always mean good to everyone in the team. And that was a fellow software engineer at Qualcomm who came into the home this morning after hearing about what had happened on the news. Uh, he had worked closely with the husband and it actually helped hire him. Uh, the home is located here at the 7400 block of uh, Via Rivera and Torrey Highlands Saturday evening just before 10 p.m. A concerned relative asked police to do a welfare check. Uh, the couple was supposed to be in San Francisco earlier that day, but never showed up. Now the couple uh, in their 50s uh, were found dead inside the home. Police not revealing exactly uh, how they died but they did note that there was no sign of forced entry. There was no one else found inside the home. Neighbors say that investigators asked them if they had heard fighting here before. Uh, they said no. Now that coworker we spoke to uh, says his colleagues had just uh, talked to the husband on Thursday. I, I, I couldn't imagine that something like this would happen to him. Um, in fact, I was talking to another colleague just now who actually met him on the Thursday in, in a team meeting and he was he, he seemed totally fine. And he also said he had met the man's wife on a couple of occasions. Uh, she was very quiet. She seemed very nice. Uh, he said his friend never gave any indication that there was any uh, any problems going on in the home. Now, uh, I did reach out to police this morning. I have not heard back on any updates.